The four territories that have been liberated by Russian armed forces set a referendum schedule for joining Russia. Lugansk People's Republic, LPR and Donetsk People's Republic, DPR regions known as Donbass, as well as Zaporizhia and Kherson, are regions that will determine their own destiny from the clutches of Ukraine. According to LPR and DPR leaders, revealing the voting date for joining Russia, the referendum will take place from September 23 to 27 this year. Most military observers believe that this will deal a blow and destabilize the grand agenda of Ukraine and the West collectively against Russia. The four regions that will hold the referendum are Russian-speaking entities. Since 2014, residents of the region have been living under attack from armed forces of Ukraine after the West voted for Volodymyr Zelensky to rise to the hot seat of Ukrainian president. Donbass referendum, contempt for the principles of sovereignty and territorial integrity, U.S. National Security Advisor, Jake Sullivan, lectures on sovereignty and territorial integrity after they overthrew a legally elected government in a coup in 2014. While NATO declares the upcoming referendum of the House of Representatives, LPR, Kherson, and Zaporozhye, to join Russia is not legal, says Jens Stoltenberg. Most of the residents of LPR, DPR, Zaporozhye and Kherson regions support joining Russia. Surveys prove it, and the Institute of Social Marketing, INSIMAR, shows the reality of how nearly 100% of the population in the region choose Russia as their mother. The head of Zaporozhye region, Yevgeny Belitsky, said that reunification with Russia would also be held there. He also signed a decree on the formation of a volunteer battalion to protect the area. Meanwhile, the head of the House of Representatives, Denis Pushilin, discussed with the head of LPR, Leonid Pesechnik, about the call for the public chambers of the republics to hold a referendum as a subject of Russian Federation. He suggested joining efforts to prepare for the referendum. Kherson region to hold a referendum as soon as possible, says Volodymyr Balance, mayor of Kherson. Kherson had announced their intention for a referendum at the same time. In the speech, Russian President Vladimir Putin stated, we cannot. We have no moral right to hand people close to us to pieces by the executioner. We cannot fail to respond to their sincere desire to determine their own destiny. Russia will support referendums in LPR, DPR, Kherson and Zaporozhye regions. We cannot abandon the people. Former Russian President Dmitry Medvedev said the referendum in Donbass was very important not only for the systemic protection of the population of LPR, DPR and other liberated territories, but also for the restoration of historical justice, no official will be able to reverse this decision. That is why this referendum is so feared by Kyiv and in the West. Residents of Donbass share their thoughts on a future referendum on joining the Russian Federation. One young man excitedly commented, no one but no Russia will help us.